Thanks for watching this Mapbox how-to video. In this video, I will show you how to create and edit data in Mapbox Studio. Like in this case, I've created two points and two polygons associated with two restaurants in Georgetown, Washington, DC. Let's go. Okay, I'm in my Mapbox Studio account. I'm at mapbox.com studio. And we want to be in the data sets section. Click on new data set and we'll stay in the blank data set section and we'll call this Georgetown Restaurants and click Create. So here's a Mapbox map. There's no data on here right now. So let's zoom into Georgetown. So I'll just type Georgetown, Washington, DC. And I want to be on M Street, M and 28. And here are two restaurants that I'd like to map. So let's start with points. You can add a point, a line, or a polygon. Let's start with a point. Drop the point here at the entrance. And here we can add properties that are associated with this point. So let's do name field, and we'll call this, this restaurant is called Das Ethiopian Cuisine. Click Confirm and click Add Property, and we'll add another one called Cuisine, and this is Ethiopian. Click Confirm. And you can also edit the point, you can move it around if you need to. So now let's also drop another point at this other restaurant, and we'll do the same thing. Name, this one is George's King of Falafel and Cheesesteak. Confirm and Cuisine, and that is Middle Eastern, and Confirm. And now let's also draw a polygon to outline these restaurants. So click on Draw a Polygon, and we'll click and click around all our corners. Click, and then double click when you're done. And we can do the same thing. So let's do Name, and this one was George's. And let's draw one around Das Ethiopian. Click, click, click. You can do any kind of shape that you want. And double click when you're done. Add property name, and this is Das Ethiopian. And click confirm. So now that we've drawn two polygons and two points, our data set's complete. So click save, save and export. And we'll click export to a new tile set and export. Now a tile set is just a collection of vector data that's broken up into uniform grid of square tiles, which just makes Mapbox maps fast and efficient. And once your data has been successfully exported to a tile set, you'll see a notification here, and then you can add this data to a style. So now you know how to create and edit data in Mapbox Studio. Thanks for using Mapbox and keep building.